member of the Information Society? That's a difficult question because I didn't know we were in the Information Society. To begin the quest, speak to Olaf just northeast of the Relica Lodestone. Climb the icy mountain to your east. Chop the tree. And speak to Olaf once again. Hit the Relica and speak to Ingrid. He is found to the east of the Grand Hall. Next, speak to Wolf by the helmet shop. Return to Olf where you started the quest once again. Speak to him. Then use the damn planks on the embers on the ground. Speak to Wolf and choose the first chat option. With the map in your inventory, go ahead and read it. Once you've read the map, go ahead and pick up the spade nearby. Head back up the ice mountain and dig right here on the same spot. Continue along the path till you find a door with some skeletons nearby. Slay a skeleton to obtain a key. The solution to the puzzle is right here on screen. It's a simple matter of just flipping the switches on the right to change the sides on the left side. Click the bottom lever to complete it. Search the door once again to pass through. In this room, go ahead and pick up six ropes. They do respawn quite quickly. And pick up two rotten barrels. Now for the most bloody annoying part of this entire quest. Head northeast and you will find this bridge. You will find certain holes in the bridge. And your task now is to use your barrel on these holes to repair them. But here's the catch. You could very easily fall off. And you will appear by Olaf and you'll have to walk all the way back. Luckily, you don't have to solve the puzzle again, but it's still very annoying. Here is where the agility boost comes into play. At times it might seem like as if you're missing something from this quest, but nope. It's just a very frustrating quest. Once you've finally made it all the way through, go ahead and click on the door and it's not even a puzzle really. Go ahead and click on the keyhole that corresponds to the key bottom that you have on the right side. In my case, it's obviously the round one, so I'll click on the round hole. Once you made it all the way through, go ahead and open the chest. Oh 
you will be attacked by an NPC. Simply slay him, there's no special mechanics involved. Once you've slain him, attempt to open the chest once again, and quest complete. 